going back historically, uh, in the medieval system, you had this liberal arts education for um, your select few leaders. And then you had um, basically apprenticeships for everyone else. If you're going to be um, the baker, if you're going to be the candlestick maker, if you're going to be the blacksmith, that's an apprenticeship to get you there. If you're going to be a lawyer, if you're going to be a teacher, if you're going to be a minister, if you're going to be a doctor, it required this rigorous liberal arts education and then with some more vocational education on top of that. That liberal arts education was just for a very select few um, bit of people because everybody else had a manual labor that did not cry, require critical thinking. It required the rote performance of a particular task. But what we're seeing is as we move forward in technology and as automation takes over um, more and more of our lives that we are all of us now in jobs that require this kind of thinking. Very few of us, uh, there are very few people that are now are still in these kinds of careers that can solely be serviced by uh, this kind of apprenticeship. Um, the, our iPhones, our laptops, our, the, the, um, the internet, every, everything that has happened technologically has moved us to a place where um, I, um, I have just on my phone a workforce that that would have you know take 10 million peasants to to perform the functions that I can have at, at my thumb tips you know um, and so I have to have that kind of education if I want to use this technology well if I want to use this technology to glorify God I need a much more rigorous and thought through um, uh, education and it's interesting because I think we're seeing that as we produce this kind of technology, but without that kind of rigorous education that goes with it, the, our level of discourse, our art, our film, our music, it goes lower and lower and lower because we're, given, we're, we're, we're being given skills without the corresponding rigorous worldview that it used to require to support it. Um, our, we're losing Christian culture because we have these machines without the brains to use them. And I think um, if we want to really um, do what God has called us to do, I mean, the Great Commission is to baptize the nations and to teach them to obey all of God's law, to, to obey and do what God has told us to do. That requires thinking. That requires a lot of thinking. And, um, and you've got all of these uh, um, devices, you've got all of this technology that we are not prepared to use because we haven't had the education necessary for it.